The photograph I chose for this assignment is actually known by many different names. It is known as the starving child and the vulture, the vulture and the little girl, or simply just the struggling girl. It was taken in March 1993 by Kevin Carter, and ironically, the child in the photograph is actually a boy. Kevin Carter was a South African photojournalist. In March 1993, Carter was offered the opportunity by the UN Operation Lifeline Sedan to travel to Sudan and report on the famine in South Sudan, which was partly caused by the area's civil war. The subject matter of this photograph was directly influenced by the culture and technology of its time. As we all know, in 1993, the internet was nothing like it is today, and there were no social medias meaning extreme poverty, political unrest, and famine were not trending topics, and information on such topics would have to be found independently, either from news outlets or personal research. The photograph is historically significant because it showed modern day starvation in a child nonetheless that hadn't been widely published and many were unaware of. The photograph was first published in the New York Times on March 26, 1993 with an article by Donatella Larch about Sedan. It caused quite a sensation, with many people immediately donating to humanitarian organizations in Sudan. Many people reached out to the Times, wondering about the child, and many more people reached out to Carter directly, confused and upset as to how and why he didn't help the child. The goal for the photograph was definitely met, not only by Carter, but also the UN Operation Lifelink Sudan. The UN Operation Lifelink Sudan hired Carter to document the famine in Sudan in an effort to secure more funding. Carter, however, was just trying to use work as a way to address some personal problems, as well as expand his freelance photography career. Since its first publication, this photograph has successfully been used to raise funds for aid organizations. This is not exactly in line with Carter's goals, since he was unaware of the aid efforts around the trip, but it did get his work well known and further his career. Kevin Carter was awarded the Pulitzer Prize for Future Photography in 1994, as well as Picture of the Year by the American Magazine. However, only months after winning these awards, Carter tragically committed suicide. In his suicide note, he wrote, I am haunted by the vivid memories of killing and corpses and anger and pain. 